Okay, now our final exercise is going to be on running reports. And to do so, we can come from our reports menu. I'm going to click on Report Center. And our Report Center opens, which has links to some of the most referenced reports within the QuickBooks Point of Sale uh, product. Now, if you're not sure which report you want to see, you can use the button down here that says Create Your Own Report. When you do that, this will open up a Create Report Wizard. which will walk you through the creation of the report that you're looking for. So for our demonstration, we're going to click a report on our item list. So we're going to go to all reports. We're going to come down here. We're going to click on items. We're going to go to our item list. And if you notice in this far left column, you have little preview buttons. And in the column right next to them, you actually have a link that goes to the report. So we're going to take a quick peek at this report so to kind of get a preview of what it would look like you just put your mouse here and you can see all the different reports for your inventory and how it would, and it get the, I guess a good idea of the look and feel so here in our item list we can preview that the department name description size on hand quantity and our cost will be on this report so we'll come over here to the right and click on display and or we can click on the item list link and you see the report populates on our screen that tells us our on-hand quantities, what our margin is, and what our cost is. So I would encourage you, as you get familiar with the QuickBooks Point of Sale software, to spend some time here in the Report Center. There's a lot of reports here, a lot of powerful reports. And if you don't find one that you that you're looking for, you can create one. So this concludes exercise number six.